Defense Minister isn't very positive about the SANDF's ability to investigate sexual exploitation and abuse. I have absolute confidence in the structures of the South African National Defense Force. But with regards to handle this particular issue, uh, my confidence is very limited. She says she won't allow abusers to hide behind their ranks and insists the SANDF must submit itself to public scrutiny. The Defense Force is a closely knit kind of institution which is able to rally around and close itself into a shell. So we open it up, not because we want to expose people, to embarrass people, we open it up because we want to correct the wrongs. Defense Union Sandu says the army desperately needs a clear policy on sexual harassment. We hope that after this task team's work is done, there would be some set of rules, policy, maybe even a bill amendment that could basically speak specifically about sexual harassment, how it will be dealt with, what kind of protection a victim or a complainant would have. The task team has three months to complete the review and will submit recommended amendments to the military discipline bill currently before parliament. Govan Whittles, Pretoria.